Hi friend, this is the rate I will move and today we are going to check out DG Bank. It is an app and what it what kind of app it is. So it is a mobile wallet app and it is available through the Play Store and the App Store so the Apple users and Android users can use this. Uh, it is very similar to the comp uh, its competitor like 811 which is run by Kotak Mahindra Bank. So why this one? So this is hassle free, it takes very less time to install it and more features we will be telling it soon throughout the video. So why Digibank app? So Digibank app uh, is brought to you by uh, Singapore's best and Asia's safest bank. The setup of an email wallet is less than 90 seconds so it is less time consuming. Shopping over 1 lakh online stores within your virtual debit card, this is an incredible thing. You can also get the cash back while shopping and also great offers on travel and entertainment. There is 24 into 7 virtual assistance for your card service. There is 7% interest from rupees 1. You have 5 rupees or you have 50 rupees, it doesn't matter, but you will get a 7% of interest. There is no minimum balance required. There is zero maintenance fees required. Unlimited and free number of ATM withdrawals are there. The cash back offers are there also for the verification it needs pan aadhar card and officers verification so here you can see it is very easy and we will do the setup and show you how it is less time consuming how you can easily do it at your home you doesn't need anything to hassle so here i will start with a new open e wallet so i will do a open e wallet and here it, it shows you it is a visa virtual debit card and also there will be cashback, great deals and 7%. The key thing is 7% as the other banks will offer you 6% of interest. Here I will write the full name, date of birth and the promotional code if I have. So the promotional code is doesn't matter. The date of birth and the full name is important because this is a document, bank document. Don't mess it with up. So this thing is what we have and after that you have to put your phone number. I am skipping the phone number. You can't see the phone number here. I am not mentioning. After the phone number, you have to rewrite your email ID twice. So once you rewrite your email ID, you again you have to write your email ID. All should be correct. Don't mess with these kind of documents because this is a government document. You will get the OTP because your phone number should be right. And also it, you will get a mail once you lost your password or your phone. So don't. Uh, give your fake details in the uh, phone number in this and later on you also have to give your username password and also reconfirm your password so this is a temporary password don't think that you got my password username should be unique so that uh, uh, it should not be similar to any other name so username and password will be unique and this is the process uh, all it takes few seconds to put it up and then once it is done we'll ask to put it accept and then go ahead so i'm just inputting it now i'm putting accept and here you can see i have already done it now i have to just uh, open uh, uh, accept my agreement and once i go inside you can see the uh, account is formed it takes a few seconds for loading so it depends on your net speed not definitely any other thing uh, it is very easy so the total time which was taken uh, as the company mentioned it takes 90 seconds but uh, it took me around 60 seconds what you can do here it is again mentioned check your balance search transaction fund transfer also the bill payments are very coming soon as you go you can also verify your account with the aadhaar and the pan card here you have to put the aadhaar details once you have done that then you have to done they do they give the pan card detail then the biometrics is required but biometrics can be done uh, to find the agent near you or you can go directly to the bank so in which city you are it depends according to that so go to your bank just get it verified and uh, once it is done the bank employees will be doing that so i'm in delhi here is the bank address for delhi also if you see the other banks which are giving around six percent of interest the best part of the uh, dg bank is that it is giving you an offer where you can do a number of limited of atm transaction and also the atm card will be free of cost where so uh, what we have seen in the other banks like uh, kotec 811 they will charge you for that here is the account management system where you can go directly and check out your account 
so this is how it is done and totally it takes a very few minutes to install and going through here all, all if all the things are correct your network is running properly uh, i will say definitely it takes like 1 minute or 1 minute 15 seconds more, not more than that 90 second is something that the company is saying because they want to have some extra time it doesn't get confused because yes 90 second is the max time in which you can set your account everything will be done so easy to do but uh, the best part is that the, they are giving you interest you don't have to run for the bank it is a paperless now also we will check the kotak 811 which is a competitor with it and uh, why it is uh, not uh, i will not suggest you to go with that so right now i am putting a new account here you can see so it is taking some time in the loading let's wait for few second here once it is loaded and now you can see it is showing up to 6% so it is not also 6% they are saying up to so uh, it it will take some time uh, now let's get started so it needs the full name i am putting the full name after that it needs the phone number which will be i will be putting in that and if i have any promotional code they can you can give the promotional code also which can be skipped so i don't have promotional code it will send an otp right now we are waiting for the otp so the otp um, we have entered it will go to another segment uh, let's wait the putting the otp here now you can see that there is a pan card detail it is asking and few more details it is asking annual income you can't skip those step if you go back you have to come again here so it is a uh, i am not asking saying that this process is not relevant but it can be skipped it can be taken later on and it is little bit lengthy process it takes around 5 minutes so we prefer dg bank over kotak 8 811 this is all about uh, the video this at the retired monk signing off please like the video share the video don't forget to the subscribe button below for us